My tonum is the shark and the emu. Just have it tattooed on my body. Shows how proud I am. Being Indigenous from my mum's side, uh, it's pretty, pretty special for myself. My mum's Torres Strait, coming from the island called Saibai, and my dad's Samoan as well. Being Indigenous, the one thing I love about it is just how proud we are of, of our culture. Three on two, and it's hammer time! You notice when I score a try, that represents the shark. Hammer so! It's hammer time! Just to showcase it out there on the big stage, it's a very proud moment for myself. I grew up in Cairns, played rugby league, uh, rugby union and AFL growing up. They were all pretty keen on me at the time. When I was about 15, I uh, moved to Brisbane Grammar on a, on a rugby scholarship and it was a pretty good school, but I got homesick while I was down there. Moving from Cairns to Brisbane, um, it's a big, big step uh, for myself, being Indigenous, close to family, going to the big city lights, uh, it was pretty, pretty daunting. The Cowboys House is a great house for young Indigenous kids from up north who are trying to excel in, in having a better education and being Indigenous, moving away from home is pretty hard. I'm the ambassador to the roles that I play there. I sort of want to get there just whenever I can, as much as I can, just to mingle with the kids and just to help them out. Here is Drinkwater again. He links up with the Hammer, who sets sail for the corner. What a speedster he is. I'm sort of um, still getting my, my head around that I am a role model for young Indigenous kids. It just gives me a confidence boost in um, to be a better person, be a better player. Granville comes back to Townsend. Pressure on Nickel Klugster. Tabuai Fado ends up with it, runs away and scores! Just being in this professional environment, there is a lot of pressure. It sort of can, can hurt you a bit, but I'd give credit to my parents. They've kept me grounded, kept me humble, just the way they've, they've brought me up. When I first came into first grade, I was probably couldn't get a word out of me on, on the field. But yeah, I am growing and I am learning new stuff every day. And yeah, I'm sort of getting that confidence up to, to speak more. And um, if I give any advice, just if you want to do something in life and you put your mind to it, just work hard because it'll, it'll all fall in place in the end. If you have a dream, chase it and just work hard for it as well.